There's Dice, Lake Temiskaming. There's Dice up here on Lake Temiskaming. Just in the marina. We finished doing our test. Oh, check the ice thickness. And then the bottom going all the way to the bottom. Fuck, you see, it's got like 10 inches just here before the bottom. So I think we're safe to walk out a little bit and do some wildlife fishing. Well, I haven't made it out of the marina. There's a pressure crack. So we'll take the shoreline and we'll check the ice again. Just out there somewhere. A little more open water, we'll see how she is. Just to stay safe. Another hole once we get over there. Try to find the channel. No, hopefully nothing bad happens. But I seen someone else walked out. So I'm gonna skip doing my second test hole and just keep working my way and hope for the best. Should only be in six feet of water or so shortly. So if I do go through a decent chance of climbing out. Okay, another update. We got out to the main lake and uh, ice was cracking a bit so I wanted to be safe. Another test hole. First I didn't think it was too much. I don't know all you can see. But uh, scoop under there. A layer of shitty ice, but from there to oh, there. I don't know. Still six inches, eight inches of good ice. So we'll keep tracking. Well it appears it appears the further out I go, the better the ice looks. Cause that is up to that little black mark there. Right there. There to the handle of solid clear ice. Four or five inches. Six inches, that's pretty that's pretty damn good right there. Oops, oh the otter fell on my back! Oh fuck that hurt. I shouldn't have left that standing up. Ah well that'll be a good video, eh? That'll be a good one. <coughs> well, I'm gonna drill a hole and test the depth. The Navionic says I'm right where I wanna be. Here on the edge of the channel. Come out there. Hopefully I'll be in like six to eight feet of water. Nice little point or something. And uh see if we can get a walleye. Okay. <coughs> a bit later than I'd hoped. But uh finally half set up. I was out there a bit. It's out there, a bit closer to the channel, but uh, just wasn't enough ice for me to feel safe. I was cracking a lot, but we're getting close to prime time, so we moved in a bit. A lot thicker ice over here. I don't know, eight, nine, ten inches maybe. So uh, even if I hear some cracking, I should be safe. A little bit closer to shore if I have to swim. But, uh, hopefully not. Let's see if we can get some fish. Well, I was just trying to eat my sub and debating whether I should move because I was still getting scared with the ice. And we got a little sauger here. Put my phone down. He's a little too small to keep. But, uh, ouch. And I forgot pliers. So I'll get this out for ya. Yo. Sharp little bugger. Come on, you. There we go. First leak to miss me fish of the day. Little baby sauger. Let's get him back real quick here. Oh, good boy. We finally got our tip up set up. So hopefully our flag will go off soon. 
But for now, we'll keep digging. Okay. <coughs> Just had a bite. I lost them or something. Oh, he's still there. Come on. Let go again. I'm sure to put my thumb down for a sec. Well, just reeled that fish up, filmed it to Sony, knew there was something small messing with me. Nice little perch, perch. I'm not gonna keep any perch because they're usually wormy in here. Bye bye. Hey, hey, look at that. We got a, we got a oh, company we got out a, here. Got a keeper. We were pulling up the tip up. It wasn't even spun free. And we got the babiest little sauger. It might be a hybrid one. I don't know. Might be a little saw guy. We'll get him back before he freezes. Didn't even set it off. Nope. Oh, we might have to keep him. Shit. Oh, no. I think that came out okay. Get the release. Come on, kick. You'll be fine. Oh, there we go. Yeah! Ha <laughs> ha!